How did Gaza and the West Bank come under Israeli occupation? In 1948, during the First Arab-Israeli War, an estimated 700,000 Palestinians fled or were pushed out of their homes. They called this the Nakba, the catastrophe. Most were left in one of two areas, the West Bank controlled by Jordan or Gaza controlled by Egypt. The conditions in Gaza were dire. Then, in 1967, during the Six-Day War, the West Bank and Gaza were taken by the Israeli military, marking the start of the Israeli occupation. The 1990s saw the start of a peace process which might have brought that occupation to an end, but it stalled. Today, Palestinians living in the West Bank have autonomy in big cities and towns, but are surrounded by Jewish settlements and are cut off by Israel's security barrier. And this densely populated strip of land has continued to be the scene of assaults and battles with Israel. Watch full video on Discover Dynasty.